Hello and welcome to the Christmas edition of our Clifton School podcast. Once again, we're here to celebrate the very best of Clifton from this half term. And we begin with the return of our class of 2022, who joined us for their certificates and awards evening in November. Accompanied by their parents, they collected their GCSE certificates and pitched up a series of individual awards celebrating their personal attributes and achievements across the curriculum. Joining Mrs Leng on the presentation party were two legends of Clifton, Pat Ironmonger and Julie Stewart, who between them have amassed almost 60 years of service at the school. It was a wonderful evening and we look forward to hearing about all their success stories over the years to come. The celebrations continued last week when our Clifton sporting heroes were acknowledged for all their superb achievements over the past year. Numerous individual and team awards were presented, including to our Team of the Year, the Year 9 Matt Sports Day team, and Sports Personality of the Year, which was awarded to both Phoebe Roberts and Adyan Musa Ashraf. All those taking part put on their dancing shoes at the end of the evening to cap off a brilliant event. To mark their 100th birthday, the BBC came to Clifton as part of their nationwide tour. All our Key Stage 3 students had the opportunity to enjoy a special assembly and hear stories of resilience and overcoming adversity from a BBC researcher. They also learnt about what it's like to work for the BBC and how students can get involved with initiatives such as BBC Young Reporters. Now we all know the importance of attendance and we are delighted that 263 students are currently on 100% attendance this half term. Those making it into our 100 club on this occasion are being rewarded with a Christmas themed celebration event in the performance hall. There promises to be copious amounts of chocolate being consumed and a special well done in particular to Year 7 who contributed the greatest number of top attenders. To enjoy success in school and in life, only effort rivals attendance. By accomplishing more CFPs than any of their peers, these students go the extra mile each and every day. A special congratulations to Bonnie Wright in Year 7, Megan Bailey in Year 8, Jermaine Gaius Egnogu in Year 9, Zadia Yashak in Year 10, and Rawa Alzindane in Year 11. This time of year is also awards season, so a huge amount of credit should go to all the students on the screen who have picked up the Head of Year Award for demonstrating the Clifton Way and the Head Teacher's Award for being a positive role model to their peers. Once again, Mrs Hammond's extracurricular class have been inspired, producing some outstanding outcomes as part of Art Club. In one session in November, students crafted their own poppies as part of the commemoration for Armistice Day. Art Club continues to run every Wednesday after school and all students are welcome. Also in art, Mrs Hammond has nominated two Year 9 students for Star of the Week. Kelly Clayton and Julia Sikakova both work extremely hard in class, going above and beyond to make their work look exceptional. Mrs Hammond explained how proud of them she is and how she's keen to ensure that their work gets some extra special recognition. In performing arts in year 10 and year 11, drama students from Clifton came together with their peers from our other secondary schools to enjoy a performance of Bouncers and Shakers at the Whole Truck Theatre. For many, it was their first taste of live theatre and it will be an extremely valuable experience ahead of their practical drama exams in the new year. Staying in performing arts, Key Stage 3 music students have had the boom whackers out this week to help them learn about rhythm, timing and ensemble awareness. This fun activity is a great gateway into developing practical skills for instruments such as the drums. Mrs Aziz was full of praise for her anxiety support group who have now completed all their designated sessions to graduate from the group. She commented on how much the girls had grown in confidence over recent weeks. And finally, we're going to end with some festive news as Lydia Rogerson has won the WPT Christmas card competition in the Key Stage 4 category. She was presented with chocolates, an Amazon voucher 
and a pack of professionally printed cards containing her unique carousel design. That's all from me. We'll be back with another Clifton School podcast next half term. Have a very Merry Christmas from all of us at Clifton.